Hey everybody, real quick video today. Um, I just wanted to, number one, give a shout out to uh, James Joyce for uh, filling me in on this little issue. But um, I literally in about five minutes here fixed a couple of problems with my excursion. Um, this is an O2 Excursion Limited V10 four wheel drive. And uh, the, the automatic four wheel drive selector on the dash quit working. Um, so I was only able to manually select or manually lock in the hubs the the automatic um function was not working any longer um and also my heat i only had heat on full temperature at you know when the the uh the setting was at 90 degrees and then um i would get heat that way but anything below that it would just blow cool air um he said this little guy right here was probably the culprit at the very least that would fix the uh, four-wheel drive selection um, and lo and behold it fixed both issues so what it is on the v10s over here on the passenger side fender wheel it's just this little vacuum solenoid okay there is two bolts one right there okay and that one you don't even have to take out all the way because it's slotted um, it's oriented like this so that side is slotted so you just got to loosen that one and take that one out all right there's the other bolt um obviously step number one disconnect negative terminal uh because electrical connection so maybe you need to maybe you don't i always do just to be safe um disconnect electrical connection disconnect this guy under your bolts and then this is your vacuum there's two vacuum lines and it's just this one boot essentially that pushes on, okay? And put the, you know, take the old one out, put the new one in in reverse order and boom, just like that. I have fully functioning heat again. Uh, my hubs lock in and out automatically like they're supposed to with the switch on the dash and probably the easiest fix I'll ever have on this thing. Um, so for you guys that are running into similar issues or the same issues, there's a heads up for you. Easy fix. The part was like, I think it was like 30 bucks or something. So quick and easy fix. And uh, I'm happy. So thanks.